Buenos dias, good afternoon, good evening, wherever you are. It's beautiful whenever you're watching this YouTube video. Welcome to the Bitcoin Family YouTube channel for the newcomers. My name is Dieter Hutu. Yes, I am recording TA videos daily, family videos daily, and I hope you completely enjoy them. So give them thumbs up and all that stuff. Today's video I'm making from my balcony here in Playa del Carmen, Mexico, enjoying the beautiful view of the sea. And I'm going to share my view on the charts today, Bitcoin charts, two other amazing cool charts I will show you and watch in uh, which part of the bull run we are. And yes, the Bam Bam indicator. And today later I'm doing a Dutch AMA. So if you speak Dutch or understand Dutch, <laughs> then watch today's second video as well when I do a AMA in Dutch on Saturday and Sunday in English. Stop talking, talking too much, keep the videos short. People love short videos. Time span, eight minutes maximum, not much talking. Let's jump into the first chart. This one guys, and bam. Get used to that one as well because yes i bam a lot um this is the four hour chart guys um i don't want to say it but i'm gonna say it i was right <laughs> i was right you know we have been looking at this chart now for weeks and uh, the last couple of days i got a lot of people discussing with me uh but i hadn't sure the pattern is not like the most safe pattern to trade um i don't know how does it look to you we have a left shoulder i'm going to draw today I'm sorry for all the background noise. Uh, that's why uh, normally I sit on my rooftop uh, and it's a little bit more quiet. But we saw this beautiful oh, left shoulder. We saw this beautiful butt head. And we saw this beautiful right shoulder. And the right shoulder is higher than the left shoulder. So that means to me that we were going to break out. And I think we just broke out. And um, oh shit, that's what I don't want to do that is I'm going to go back like this and, and we broke out and I measured at that time from the breakout we should be breaking to the neckline from here and then you paste it over there and then the breakout should be around 68k we already went to 61k of course mostly guys mostly I'm going to draw that as well mostly why is my drawing tool not beautiful yellow anymore I don't know mostly you go up you come down you retest this area and then bam you go up that is how it mostly moves i don't know if it is going to move like that now maybe we'll go on one way we only look at the charts and if we look at history so if you look uh, to the left on the chart or is left on the no, left on the chart i don't know um, you normally you see the pattern of breaking out retesting that line and then going to the upside um, and it's still in this huge fifth wave the going there in my opinion but let's see because the green we can see here on the four hour chart the green starts to decline the bam bam starts to go downward the moment we cross this white line to the downside uh, that's an exit for us if we enter the long and did we enter the long i will show you that later in the video if you want to know more of the bam bam indicator or how to trade the bam bam indicator then please go to the discord channel or click one of the links down below this video so you can see how to join the TikTok and the bam bam indicator but again later i will show you more but there was the four hour chart of bitcoin i think it's a really beautiful chart beautiful pattern let's see if we can make it to 68 uh, 8k please be aware it is the weekend and the weekend we see crazy pumps and then mostly on mondays we pull back to the cme gap chicago mercantile exchange gap that is where they closed on friday check google cme gap bitcoin friday then you see the not the price would close at friday mostly on monday when those guys wake up and go to their jobs with the suits um yeah they want to trade back to that cme gap point of friday so be aware of that but let's jump into the next chart this one bam glass note i uh, hope my internet is not abandoning me but don't worry about a thing because every little thing is gonna be all right okay we have the chart guys check this chart beautiful chart what is this chart showing you you see it in the top of the screen bitcoin transfer volume from miners to exchanges all exchanges so how many bitcoins is flowing from the miners to the exchanges that is what we are seeing here and we can see 
but mostly I'm, I'm checking if we are still recording guys because there is a lot of noise in the back here but yeah we will still recording mostly we see before we go into this huge bull run here this is 2017 20k the price and just before you see this huge increase of miners uh, sending their bitcoins to the exchanges why why do you think because the miners want to sell in profit so before this huge bull run you see these peaks of inflows into the exchanges from the miners we saw it also last year here 2019 just before this 14k uh, high huge increase of inflows from the miners to the exchanges if we look to today what do we see down here on the right this is nothing this is nothing we are not even near the peaks that we saw here we did we are not even near so this is like we are not in the bull run maybe i can zoom in a little bit so that you see it better uh, so you can see it a little bit better ah, did it like this look here these peaks these were the minor inflows all the way up here to the top here before 2019 the 14k all inflows into the top now this it's nothing we already increased this much with only these minor inflows they are not selling the miners are not selling very important to understand this the miners are not selling why is it important if miners are not selling they believe we didn't reach a top yet if you see these inflows of miners going to the exchanges again that is the moment we need to start watching out looking out because that could be the moment to be near the top and this chart bam same here bitcoin spent out Output profit ratio the SOPR what does it mean the spent output profit ratio in short the price sold divided by the price paid always when we are on these bull runs like here we go to these huge numbers here of 1.02 to 1.08 that was the top in 2017 here in 2019 the top you know the 14k top we went also almost to 1.08 huge number now we are not even near we are here this is nothing <laughs> also nothing 1.04 we still have a long way to go before we uh, top out in this bull run in my opinion and i'm going to show you this uh, by showing you yesterday's trades hopefully my face was not again in the image i keep doing that wrong that's because of this uh, um, you know this this OBS thing I still need to get used maybe I need to make it a little bit smaller bam my face gets smaller um, and let's jump into this one bam here this is beautiful to see guys I'm going to show you and draw a little bit before before you oh, stumbling today what is happening maybe the effect after effect of all the alcohol but we traded yesterday with 500 US dollar with a leverage of 10 and we did two trades a short uh, this was a short trade uh, we made 36 dollar that's nada it was only 0 0.7 percent and then we were having this huge trade this one here bam this one was a good trade we uh, created from 536 dollar uh, we created from this one that one bam 794 us dollar why did we go into this trade because all the alarms were ringing i had three alarms ringing on my telephone there was a long flag there was a closing candle above the yellow stepping line there was a bull sign on the bitcoin TikTok indicator you can see that one over there and you can see the long flag over there and we can see the bam bam there crossing this white line that was an indication we saw the green dot over there we saw the green increasing over there all these alarms started think wrinkling you need to buy you need to buy you need to buy so that is why i took that long and yes during that long when i was in profit um, i set a trailing stop loss like you can read here in the text and that is now of course why i am in profit and yes this is not that easy as i'm telling you now because you need to analyze the charts a little bit you need to read the 130 a page pdf with all your information about the bam bam tiktok march goal so that you understand it but the longer and the more you will use it the more you will understand all of these beautiful strategies um, i want to show you two more things on this one uh, that is this one over here guys net transfer volume from and to exchanges uh, in the 200 day moving average this what we see down here is wow again the wrong one did he god damn wake up this what we see over there bam this 
is never seen before here this was 2017 now this is huge this means there's a lot of bitcoins transferred from exchanges to hardware wallets while at the same time exchanges are more safer and safer to hold all your bitcoins so what does that mean so now it's way more safer than in 2017 to hold all your bitcoins on an exchange and then there was a small outflow and now in the very safe time we are living to hold your bitcoins in exchange there is a huge outflow this means what is this go this means that there is a lot of people holding the bitcoin and trusting bitcoin to go may higher 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 and that is what we can see on this one bam yes a little bit unstructured today sorry for that it's saturday give me a break i need a break um the bitcoin cumulative 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 the bitcoin cumulative return after halving per epoch which means every time when there's a halving the, uh, the cumulative returns on investment is a percentage and we can see how high we went in the first one 2012 2016 we went all the way up to uh, this area here bam nine thousand percent and then in 2016 2020 we went all the way bam here three thousand percent now we are here where do you think we will go we will not go down in my opinion we will go to somewhere there maybe two thousand percent in total which would be a beautiful area but let's see or maybe i'm drawing this one wrong you know ah diddy come on maybe it will be even uh, slower you know maybe we'll even go like bam there all possible but we are not at the end of the bull run that is the most important lesson of today <laughs> it's still time for plan b guys time for plan b we are not at the end of the bull run we are seeing a pullback and we are still on time if we want to sell our house sell a third car or second car the motorbike whatever you want to sell to go into bitcoin because we are still foreseeing i am still foreseeing not we i still foresee that there will be a shitload of profits when you start to buy bitcoin out that was everything for today it was too unstructured i know i need to cut a few things out probably but if you did enjoy the video give the video a thumbs up share it with your friends and family subscribe to the channel hit the notification bell and please leave a comment about it's time for plan b today because i love to respond to your comments thanks for watching enjoy today's dutch ama later uh, and yes i'm going to zoom out in bitcoin now and i'm going to zoom in that life having a beautiful breakfast with this amazing view enjoying every little single minute of the day thanks for watching and hopefully see you later today or tomorrow in the english ema again if something strange happens on sunday i will make a ta video on sunday as well thanks for watching and tuning out now bam